Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you guys how to install the newest um, Minecraft server, version um, 1.2.4. Um, in this update, um, Notch has fixed many things, including all of these right here that are highlighted. Um, these are a few general fixes. Players and mobs and lava or fire no longer spam sound effects. Uh, lava flows further in nether. Um, yeah, you guys can look through the list if you want to see what's changed. Um, I'm going to show you guys how to um, install the new server. So just go to minecraft.net and then go to the download page. Scroll down to multiplayer alpha server software and then depending on your operating system um, you're gonna choose um, either the jar file or the executable. Um, in my case, I'm gonna download the executable because I'm running Windows, obviously. So I'm just gonna click it, save file, and then I am going to place it in a folder. Go to new, and then let's type Minecraft-server. I'm gonna open up the containing folder that this file is currently in. I'm going to drag it over. I'm going to close those windows. Double click. Rename it as Minecraft Server. Now I'm going to run it for the first time. I'm going to hit run. And now it's going to create all the necessary files for the server to run properly, like it has so far. And then it's going to close itself in a second, meaning that it successfully created everything it's needed to. Just give it a second. Patience. I'm going to close that in the meantime. Alright, it says done for help. Type help or a question mark. Um, so now we can close it. There we go. And now what we're, we're going to want to do is we're going to open up command prompt. Now we're going to type IP config. Now we're going to get our IPv4 address. In our case, it's in my case it's 192.168.1.4 so I'm gonna open up my server.properties file with notepad um, to open it with notepad just right click it and click open with and then select notepad and then I'm gonna go to server IP equals 192.168.1.4 I'm now gonna go over to file and hit save I'm gonna close that I'm going to close my command prompt and now I'm going to open up my browser and I'm going to go to my router's IP address. To find out what your router's IP address is, open up command prompt, um, type in IP config, and then scroll up to where it says default gateway. This is your gateway for your router. So I'm going to type 192.168.1.1. I'm going to log in. And then I'm going to go down to port forwarding slash port triggering. Um, I'm using a Netgear router. It may be different depending on the router you're using, um, but I'm sure it's there. So you're going to click add custom service. And now you're going to open up server.properties again. And you're going to look for server port. Now, um, this is a port that Minecraft will be listening on. So two two. So 25565. So let's name it Minecraft. Make it TCP slash UDP. And then we're going to select the port 25565, which is a port that Minecraft is currently running on. If you wanted to change the port for any particular reason, such as another program running on that port, you could um, name it, you could give it a name 1 through 65,534. So just close that. And then the ending port is going to be the exact same port. And now we're going to hit apply. And um, the reason I got a failure is because I've already port forwarded. As you can see right here. And so um, after you do that, let me just switch that here. Um, after you do that, you're ready to log into the server and start it up. So I'm just going to start the server by double clicking this. And it's preparing to start the region. And it's done. 
So now you can log in and play on the server by opening up the client and clicking login and going to multiplayer. Now because you're logging in via to the same computer that the server is running on, you're going to use your um, IPv4 address, which is the address you can find again by going to command prompt typing ipconfig and finding this one right here now if you are someone from the outside world um, they connect via to your internet IP address which can be found at cmyip.com this IP address um, followed by a colon and your port number will enable anyone to connect to your server because we port forwarded our routers IP address and so let's just log in here and as you can see it's saying logging in and so we're on the server so this is how you um, set up a minecraft server thanks for watching please subscribe write comment if you have any questions and I'll see you next time